Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. These, of course, the scenes inside the Stade Louis Dur, decorated in the colours of AS Monaco. And already we're underway here. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. That needed to end with efficiency and incision, and we got neither. Delson Martins goes looking. Keita. Forward it goes. And it's Keita. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Plays it out to the wing. Adrian Silva. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern, and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. Jemison. Gus Martins. Bakayoko tries to get it forward quickly. Nelson Martins. Adrian Silva. Golovin. Adrian Silva. Bakayoko. Now it's Slimani. Adrian Silva. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Great strength on the ball. Lovely bit of skill. Not long till half time, and it is still goalless. Golovin, and it's Slimani. Keita. Battles to win it back. Pinged one through here. Deflected behind for a corner kick. Good clearance and very necessary. Hoists it forward. And the first 45 minutes are up. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? It's been a pretty abject performance. No efforts at goal. I'm struggling to remember the last time we had that. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. So we're already into the second period. No score in the first half, who's ready to go for it now? Chip through. To throw in.
it's Slimani. Put offside that time. Away from immediate danger. Golovin. Bakayoko. Well positioned to make that interception. Goes direct to the front line. And he's there to clear it. Now it's Ben Yedda. Now it's Slimani. Delson Martins. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does a great leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. And it's played forward. Now it's Slimani. Ben Yedda looks to thread it through. Camille Glick. Keita. Camille Glick. Bakayoko. And here's Ben Yedda. Silva. And here's Slimani. Does Martins. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. And here's... Ben it's Ben Yedda! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. For a change in personnel, two changes being made right now. Tries to get it clear. Just brushed off the ball there. Monaco showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Slimani pushes to get on the end of it. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And 90 minutes are up, 30 more to come.